We all have heard that phrase. Your deck takes no skill. Or meta decks take no skill. And let me take let me pick apart those phrases. For the first one or the second one, meta decks takes no skill. So you're saying meta deck takes no skill. So if my non meta deck and it becomes meta, is it all of a sudden skillless? That's a question that she should ponder about. Are you saying that all non-meta decks take skill? I don't know why, I do not know why you could play and say these things without putting any real thought into it. So, your, your, your deck takes no skill. They say Dark Wills, Ice Wounds, Spellbook, Fire Fist, all of those things take no skill. And the main excuse that I hear about them not taking skill or not having skill is because they summon a whole bunch of monsters in one turn. And they say you didn't have to think about doing it. Okay. So, I don't think they're really complaining about the deck not taking skill. In my opinion, all decks take a level of skill. The cards dictate what you're going to do. You do what the cards say. You perform an action and you win. I think Yu-Gi-Oh players are saying the game has become too fast. That's what I think they are saying. I think they are saying your deck takes no skill because they don't know how to say that the game has become too fast. Because Konami prints up these cards, you're given a chance to play with them, they tell you what to do. So to a level, a lot of decks don't take skill. You just read the card and you do what the card says. Now, in my opinion, luck comes when you draw your opening hand. It takes skill to use those cards that you draw to win. That's what it takes. And it's the order of which you activate the cards. And it is the timing of which you activate the cards that takes skill. That's what it is. You can't say if you draw a rescue rabbit first turn, activate rescue rabbit's effect, summon two dinosaur monsters, and then overlay for log takes no skill. You can't really say that. Konami made the card for them to do that. It's a card just like any other card. They're supposed to do that. That's the game. That's the effect. That's what you do. What would make that action become skillful? I think Yu-Gi-Oh players are saying that Konami has made it too easy for them to be able to do that. Not that it didn't take any skill. I think they use, like I said, I think they're using the wrong phrase. Konami has made it too easy. If they had to perform some type, to if they had to, to fulfill some type of requirement before they summon the rabbit, that may may have taken skill or some type of build up to it. I think that Yu-Gi-Oh players are saying that there's no build up to anything. The game is too much. You draw what you have and you just do it. Do it right away. It's just it's, it's too fast, it's too immediate, and there's no build up. I think that's what Yu-Gi-Oh players are saying. The game itself has no skill because there's no build up. Or to the requirements or to the things you want to do. How do you, if you rescue rabbit, summon Lagia, I mean, that was just too easy. Now he has control over the whole field from that one card that turned into two cards that turned into a 2400 monster that negates anything. I just don't, under, I just don't know that, that answer. So that's why I'm asking you for the Yu-Gi-Oh question of the day to leave a comment in the comment section below so your comments could be featured on the next Yu-Gi-Oh question of the day. Answer that question. What defines skill in Yu-Gi-Oh?